I'm Martino Justino and this is my movie review today of Anger from 1967 by Tonino Valeri, starring two of the all-time greatest actors Giuliano Gemma and Lee Van Cleef. The young poor man, Scott works a street and porch sweeper in Clifton, Arizona, for almost nothing and gets treated by every inhabitant like shit, except his old friends Smurf Allen and Blind Bill, due to his being a bastard. He saves the few dollars he rarely gets for his dream of getting a cold. A opportunity to change his life and escape shows up when the gunfighter Frank Talby comes in town. Scott quickly feels bond to and, res and respects Frank, who agrees to teach him the lessons and essentials about gunfighting. Day of Anger is a great and well-paced build-up of an angered young man with desires and ambitions of being a gunslinger and got treated like shit for his whole life. With Lee Van Cleef as the seemingly heroic and flawless quick gunslinger Frank Telby and Idol for Scott, who's played by Giuliano Gemma, we got two of the best Western actors of all time, along with you know, Clint Eastwood, Gian Maria Volonte, Franco Nero, Terence Hill, Klaus Kinski, Charles Bronson. The combination and first encountering disagreements and the gap of experience between both is an interesting development of both characteristics and the reactions in the, we get in the last third of the movie. For 110 minutes, we see a not rushed change of Scott's behavior, reactions, changes of interests and the need of quick and well thought decisions he has to make. He develops his skills and uses the lessons he got from Frank first to help others and got also trapped as a loved and hated gunfighter at the same time. The soundtrack accompanies the whole movie great and like I said it all ends up as a goosebumps causing last third with magnificent uh, shot gunfight scenes and a few twists. Unfortunately the first time I saw the movie I already knew that it would have a sad turn and however the end would have been it would have seemed a little bit unsatisfying and still sad. The focus isn't just in the character development and mental changes of Scott, but also him being torn between multiple fractions and the need to keep himself humbled underneath his new burden, responsibilities and also the legendary skills he got. The main theme in the soundtrack is at least a 7 out of 10, the acting a 10 out of 10, unquestionable, especially by Lee Van Cleef and the combination with Giuliano Gamer, both of my all-time favorites and the setting locations, well, it mostly played in the town Clifton in Arizona and a little bit in the desert of Arizona, so a 7 out of 10. The effects a 7 out of 10. The story was extremely well, not too fast rushed and I gave it a 9 out of 10. It had a few little logical uh, issues. The message a 7 out of 10, I mean, I can't spoil the end for you, but the outcome wasn't so satisfying. Once or twice we got uh, distracted from the former message and the desires, goals of both characters. A total score, 7.8 out of 10 for this movie. I highly recommend this movie. It's one of the best westerns. So yeah, thanks for watching.